In the last video, we have discussed the basics of CRM and how you can use it for data analysis and marketing strategies. If you haven't watched it, go and click on this link above. Now we will discuss the benefits of CRM further in this video. As you may have gathered from our previous videos, there are a lot of uses for a CRM, like understanding customers, gathering data, and analyzing data for marketing. Additionally, there are a lot of strategies and smart business decisions that you can do using the analyzed data from CRMs. There are plenty of large companies that use CRM not only because it is a smart strategy or a great way to store data, but it also has a lot of benefits. No matter what business you're in, a CRM model and strategy can prove to be useful. Here are some of the promises of effective CRM. First is increase in revenue and profitability. As mentioned in our previous videos, a CRM platform or software helps you see which campaigns are working and which ones are not. This gives you an opportunity to focus on the campaigns and strategies that are producing the most revenue. Additionally, it helps you see which campaigns are tanking so you can go back to the drawing board and revise your strategy. At the end of the day, this will help you achieve an increase in revenue and profitability. Second, improved customer satisfaction and loyalty. CRM software also provides you with detailed data regarding each customer. It makes it easier for you to know your customer's purchase history, preferences, and more. In return, you can use this data to provide a more valuable service or product to your customer. This strategy leads to improved customer satisfaction and loyalty to the brand. Third is improved service delivery and operational efficiencies. Did you know that you can also connect or integrate most CRM software to different apps? Yes, you can. With the data you already have in the integrations, you can provide improved service delivery and operational efficiency for your customer base. Maybe you're wondering if you can integrate CRM to social media, then this video will help you. Fourth is reduction of acquisition cost. Let's face it, one of the toughest obstacles any organization has is the cost of attracting clients. Sometimes the cost of acquiring a new customer are higher than the return. With CRM, the need to spend a lot on new client acquisition decreases. Additionally, the retention of existing customers is also cheaper. This is why it is important to invest in a CRM platform or software. It may seem like a lot of money to invest at first, but it is all worth it. After all, these costs are significantly less compared to the increase you will see in revenue. Fifth is the value of CRM in every perspective. As we said, CRMs can provide a lot of benefits for every company. To help you understand the value of a CRM even better, here are its value in every perspective. Looking at CRM from a marketing perspective is one of the most effective ways to increase the number of people who know about your service or product. And as we all know, the more prospects, the more potential customers. To implement CRM in your marketing strategies, here are some suggestions. First, use personalized targeting and profiling. Second, cross-check that with a range of marketing channels like social media marketing, email marketing, and telemarketing. Third, have a deeper understanding of what your customers wants and needs. Then lastly, offer the right mix of your products and services in front of each customer and make sure that the timing is correct based on your data. On the other hand, if you look at a CRM from a cost perspective, there are a lot of benefits. For instance, it helps decrease the amount you spend on customers. Because we all know, gaining a new customer would cost more than keeping a current one. If you look at a CRM from a sales standpoint, the benefits are similarly as great. A CRM helps turn the people who know about your service or product, from the marketing perspective, into customers. To implement CRM in your sales strategies, here are some suggestions. First, make sure that each customer receives the correct product offers. And then second, make sure that the sales-related processes are carried out within the organization. Lastly, if you look into CRM from a service perspective, it is a great way to ensure people who have interacted with you in the past are satisfied with your service. Applying all the CRM data you have with effective marketing strategies can create a new and reinforced referral force for your company. Yes, we are referring to happy customers who are delighted with your service. They are often the ones who do the marketing for you through positive word of mouth. To implement CRM in your service and fulfillment strategies, try to improve whatever service you're currently giving your customers by integrating a better email response management, 
providing a social media support system, improve on queue and workflow management, and provide problem resolution systems and workflow automation. If you wish to integrate CRM into every aspect of your business, which we highly recommend you to do, it is useful to know how you can implement it in different ways. These are only some of the known benefits of CRM software. Once you get used to how it runs and operates, you will see more benefits for your brand and company. If you want to know how to implement a CRM strategy step by step, watch this video. Should you integrate CRM to social media? This video will help you.